abs of steel, shoulders of stone. Ridiculous. Not what you'd expect from a 64 year old man, but that's why Robert Durbin is known as the rock hard papa. Just after I started working out and everything else, and it, my grandkids all call me Papa and stuff, so I just, rock hard Papa just come, come to me naturally, really. Robert has a physique most 20 somethings would kill for and the endurance to go with it. But he hasn't always been like this. This was Durbin just seven years ago, out of shape, barely able to walk without a cane, suffering from a descending aortic aneurysm, afraid he might not get much more time with his grandkids. I just got tired of couldn't do nothing with my kids, my grandkids, or anything else. So. Decided to go to gym. Robert's journey to fitness all started here at the Southwest YMCA when he came in and got on a treadmill. He hasn't looked back since. We work out for an hour, hour and a half, two hours. Uh, we do a CrossFit section. I do weights, do a lot of bar work, calisthenics. Uh, then leave the gym, and I'll work on the bars at the house a little bit. And then uh, I'll come back three nights a week for kickboxing, uh, kettlebell class, and yoga. He's always been dedicated. Like he would choose a hobby and stick with it and perfect it. And when he started to focus on his body, that's when he really found his niche. That's his thing. That's what he was meant to do. <laughs> Robert's daughter, Tiffany Villier, is his partner in the gym. And as you can see, he has no trouble keeping up with her. In fact, she struggles to keep up with him. Who works out harder, you or him? Him. <laughs> He's, I mean, from the minute that he wakes up. It's living proof that health and fitness don't come with an expiration date. I feel better now than I do when I was 18. And while Robert says it's hard work every single day, he says it's worth it to have his health and his life back. Brooke Katz, WHAS 11 News.